full length. I'm really happy to be here. My first time in uh, in the South Africa India team. Uh, it's been an amazing day for me. I have seen all the team, uh, all the people. It's uh, it's like a big family. So it was really nice for me to be here today. I will do the, a lot of uh, Friday morning, so it's going to be really important for me. I will try to help the team obviously to to work with them, try to improve the car, try to to be as more professional as I can and uh, I will try to just do my best and uh, learn a lot uh, a lot with them. And we know uh, that uh, it's a really good team for, um, they are coming really good team now. Uh, they, had, they have done a big improvement in the past, uh, in the last three years. So I'm really happy to be with them, to work with them and uh, I, will do, I will do my best. Well, obviously uh, I will have the chance to drive a Formula One. Now it's not, uh, it's not every day because uh, with the new rules, it's not possible to have uh, testing as you, as you want. So it will be a big key for me to, to have a uh, track time in, uh, in Formula One and to continue to grow up with, uh, with my driving experience. So I will, uh, I will learn a lot this year for sure. It will be an amazing season for me and uh, I will have, a, I will have to, to do a really good job with, uh, with the team. Well, it's been pretty busy already, the uh, January, you know, um, the break was over um, after New Year. Been a couple of times here in the UK, in Silverstone, at the factory or in the simulator, um, following up what, what people are doing here, how the car is going, the development of the car. And besides that, um, yeah, getting myself back into shape. Um, I've done a nice training program to get myself ready for the season. I'm uh, really excited, you know, to to start the season, but obviously also testing to drive the car out of the garage the first time in, in Jerez. And, you know, it's it's been a long year on the sidelines, so I'm obviously very happy to, to be back um, and to be racing again, so I'm really looking forward to it. Yeah, I think I need to, to get off the rust a little bit, you know, of not having raced one year. Obviously, uh, the racing skills are basically still there, but I think surely it needs some refreshments, you know, and um, Hopefully that doesn't take too long. We have a, you know, the whole February of testing, um, trying to get me as familiarized with everything as possible, and then we'll see how it goes. I rate Paul quite high. If you look at, at his career record, he's been very strong everywhere he's, where he's driven. Um, he had a very strong season last year. He's going to be even stronger this year. Um, we're both in our second year, so I think we both have very competitive natures, and it's going to be... Uh, tough, but I'm obviously I'm trying to make his life as difficult as I can. Well, personal expectations are difficult to, to name or to give you a number, but definitely it's my second year. I need to establish myself in Formula One. That's what I want. Um, so, yeah, I just want to, at the end of this year and the end of 2012, want to look back at the year at uh, many races and, you know, just be happy about what we have achieved. No, very much looking forward to it. I think it's obviously a big day. Um, all the hard work that's went into the car uh, throughout last year. You know, you, you change your philosophy mid-season to put the put the work into design, um, and being involved in it over the winter through the various simulator sessions. Um, it's obviously quite an exciting time, and it just gives you a bit of a an idea of where you're going to lead into the first part of the year. Um, and hopefully that will be positive, given where we left off last year. I think everybody's still in a good buzz. And um, it certainly would be good to, to get to Melbourne um, with a strong package and enable us to score some good points. The winter's been quite a bit different this year. Um, and for some reason, it's been a lot more relaxed. Um, I think just second year in Formula One, it's a bit different. Since the 28th of December, um, the focus has just been on training. Uh, and I've worked throughout that, you know, through, the, through about three or four hours each day um, through various strength sessions, swimming, cycling, a bit of yoga, um, and really just mixing it up as best as I can. Um, and I feel very prepared at the moment. Hopefully I've not put on too much weight, um, but you know, I'll need to get myself trimmed up um, ahead of the first Grand Prix. I think we certainly want to look with ambitions of becoming fifth as a constructor. Um, you know, but to do that, we have to overtake Lotus, which is going to be a remarkable job. But I, I think we would be very happy with just being where we are, and that's sixth, um, certainly in front of the, the Saubers and Toro Rossos. And I believe that can be achieved at the beginning. Um, the next step is going to be a big one. Um, but I think everybody's up for the challenge. 
But at the same point, we all need to raise our game to make that happen.